Welcome to Sauce Labs, where we help you test at the speed of awesome. Today, I'm going to show you how to test a native mobile app with Sauce Labs, so you can accelerate development and help your organization achieve modern app development goals like continuous integration, continuous delivery, and DevOps. For this demo, I'll test a simple iOS mobile app running locally on an iOS simulator. The app calculates tips by letting me enter the total check amount, tip percentage, and number of guests. The app then returns the correct tip and the amount each person owes. This is an iOS app, so I need to verify that it works on all my users' latest devices before it can submit it to the Apple Store for certification. I'll use Sauce Labs to do that instead of spending the time, money, and effort to set up my own internal lab with hundreds of physical devices. Sauce Labs gives me instant access to all the Android emulators, iOS simulators, and real devices I need to test my mobile web apps, hybrid, and native apps. And I can do it all in the cloud. Sauce Labs is based on Appium, the open source standard for automated mobile testing for both Android and iOS. So there's no need to modify my application just for testing purposes. The code I test is the code I deploy. And Appium is built on top of Selenium, so you can write Appium tests in the programming language of your choice and share them between development teams and projects. Running automated tests on Sauce Labs begins with choosing a testing framework. And Sauce Labs offers dozens of sample frameworks on GitHub to help you get started. Once you select your framework, you need three main elements to run your tests. The first is your Sauce Labs account name and access key. The second is a definition of your target test environments. We'll run this test on three iOS simulators and two real devices, an iPhone 6 and an iPhone 6S. And the final element is the location of where you'll run your Appium driver. So instead of pointing to an internal grid or lab, we're pointing to the Sauce secure endpoint that will serve as our Appium server. And here's our example test. We're going to make sure that when we enter the price of $100 and the tip percentage of 20%, that the app produces the correct tip amount of $20. So we'll kick off our test with a simple command from the terminal, then switch over to watch the Sauce Labs dashboard to see our tests in action. The Sauce Labs dashboard is where you can see all your manual and automated tests running in real time. The left rail of the dashboard lets you access Sauce Connect Proxy, our secure tunneling tool that allows you to securely test applications and access data from behind your firewall, and below that are links to test archives, Sauce Labs documentation, and a speedometer showing the number of concurrent sessions you're running. The speedometer shows 35 concurrent sessions running seven tests across my different OS, browser, and real device combinations. And the tests are all being run in parallel, which slashes my testing time while increasing test coverage. And Sauce Labs always spins up new, pristine VMs in the Sauce Labs cloud, and starts real devices that have been completely clean for individual tests. So I never have to worry about data from residual tests causing false positives. In fact, Sauce Labs has a 95% reliability rate for real devices running both iOS and Android. That's the highest in the industry. The tests are highlighted in blue on the left as they run, and we can see the icons indicating whether the test is running on an iOS simulator or on a real device. Sauce Labs gives me instant access to a wide range of browsers, operating systems, and device types, including older versions and the latest updates and beta versions. The far right column shows which tests are still running, which have passed, and which have failed. Let's give it a few seconds to finish up and then see how we did. So all my tests are complete, and because I was running them in parallel, they only took three minutes to finish. Running those same tests in series without Sauce Labs would have taken 75 minutes. So I just completed testing the critical functions of my mobile app 25 times faster. But it's not just about speed, because Sauce Labs frees you from dedicating your time and resources to maintaining your own test infrastructure. So you can focus all your resources on delivering a great app. And Sauce Labs improves your team's productivity by making it very easy to analyze test results. My test on the iPhone 6S real device running iOS 9.3 failed. So I'll click the test and drill down to see screenshots, logs, and metadata and I can watch video playback of tests run on Android devices. A quick look at the screenshots shows that my tip amount isn't being calculated correctly. So instead of $20, my app is showing $20,000. So I've clearly identified a bug that I need to submit to the appropriate dev resources. And Sauce Labs has you covered there too with our Jira integration. So I can just click the Create Jira Issue button to connect to my local Jira instance, and then select the correct dev team for my project dropdown list. This is a bug report, and I'll add a quick description of the problem. I can then add any of my test assets and click the Create Issue button to generate a JIRA ticket. So Sauce Labs lets you share test results with team members, collaborate on solutions, and speed the time to resolution. And that's it. 
With Sauce Labs, you can accelerate your testing, improve quality, and keep your entire team focused on delivering an amazing mobile app. Already using Appium and want to get started on testing simulators or emulators with Sauce Labs? Then sign up for a free trial today. Or if you're interested in an enterprise trial that also includes access to real devices, contact us at sales at saucelabs.com. Thank you.